Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Thanks to the team over at Basic Fun UK. In today's video we're going to be checking out two of their all new Tiny TV classics, both of which are Family Guy themed as well as the Big Bang Theory themed. Now for those of you looking to add either of these to your collection, I shall of course include a link down in the description box below where you guys can check these out for yourselves. I do believe there is also a Batman themed one, so that definitely is really really cool and I personally am super excited to actually see as to what these are all about as I believe they are in fact supposed to scale with your action figures and I will in fact actually post some size comparisons throughout this particular video but they're actually a really cool and interesting concept as they are indeed a real working TV you can see they come with real working remotes and they will include clips from both season one to season two of Family Guy and then this one here will include clips from season four of the Big Bang Theory so as we just take a look here at the packaging you can see we've got some promotional art from each of the shows and then as we spin around here to the back of the box you can see some of the differences between the two such as a variation in the actual TV as well as the remote and you can see here that there are in fact a few different variations of TV that you get depending on what show or movie you do pick them from. So we've got the Ultra Retro which is 50 to 60s, the Retro 70 to 80 and then the Millennial which is 2010 to the current day. So without further ado let's crack these open and see what they're all about. And so here we have both of the tiny TVs cracked open and out of the packaging and they are essentially exactly what it says on the box. They are tiny TVs, they work in essentially the exact same way as you would expect from a real life large TV and I've got to be honest and say that they've actually turned out a lot better than I could have personally ever possibly imagined. Now we'll very quickly go over the detail. Here we've got the Family Guy TV. You can see here that in regards to sculpt work it's actually pretty decent especially in regards to the back detailing. You can see you've got where all of the different cables would of course insert. We've got some nice vent detailing here at the top as we spin around to the side. We've got various different buttons which you can also utilize however personally I do prefer utilizing the actual included remote control. We've got the stand attachment and you can also see here the actual TV screen. This has been completely molded out of a grey piece of plastic and for the most part actually looks fairly accurate. You can see we've got a few different licenses on the base but definitely really really interesting. Now in regards to its actual functionality there are a few ways of which you can utilise this. So as mentioned you can use the buttons here on the side if you don't want to use the remote and just to very quickly demonstrate that you simply just want to turn this power on. Now there will be a slight jump cut as sadly I am unable to actually showcase the intro for Family Guy as well as the Big Bang Theory due to copyright so I shall just jump straight into the clips and skip the intro but rest assured the intro is in fact included on this particular TV so just to demonstrate you just want to power this up here So we've skipped the intro and as you can see here we've jumped straight into the clips and you can see the actual quality of the clips I believe has turned out so so well. Definitely really really high resolution there. You can see completely colourised and actually looking very very impressive. Now you can see here that it will begin to play a variety of different clips from both season 1 and season 2 of Family Guy and all of the clips are completely uncensored which is exactly what you would want here from the show. So just to demonstrate a few different features you can see here with the remote control we've got the power on and off which I'll showcase towards the end of the demonstration. We've got here the pause and the play, which is super, super cool. So you can see you can just pause that whenever you want and it will freeze frame. We've also got the volume control so we can raise the volume up all the way to the top or all the way down. And we've also got a channel skipper so you can in fact actually skip the channel. So let's demonstrate the audio as well as how to actually change the channel. So let's just play this. And then if you wish to jump clips, you just simply push channel. And then as you can see, it will begin to play a variety of different clips. Honestly, there's so many on here that I haven't actually gone all through them and they do play in their entirety, which is really, really awesome. Now, in order to actually power this particular one off, you simply just push this switch here at the top. And you can see how you'll get the coloured bars and of course you've got that interference noise and then the TV will in fact power off. And I actually think that's so, so cool. So definitely really, really awesome where this Family Guy one is concerned. Be sure to stick around to the end of the review where I'll hopefully play a few of the different clips in darker lit lighting conditions just so that you can truly appreciate the display screen. But moving our attention here on to the Big Bang Theory, you can see how they are actually different in regards to the television. So you can see how this particular TV appears to be slightly more modern than the Family Guy one as so does the remote control which is really cool. 
and this works in the exact same way although all of the buttons are in fact here on the back instead of on the sides so in order to power it up you can simply push this button or you can push the remote you can see you get the basic fun logo as well as the intro which sadly I will have to skip. And much like the Family Guy version you can see how the screen is completely colorized and we actually have proper clips from the show. So just to give you a few demonstrations just press the play button. And you can press play and pause in the exact same way and of course power the TV off if you wish to turn it off. And it actually turns off in a different way when in comparison here to the Family Guy one. So I really, really do love the differences in models. The way they power up and power on is different and the actual design of the TV is different as well. I'd really like to try and pick up an old retro one as I think that would be really, really awesome. But definitely very, very fun. Works a lot better than I was expecting, especially in regards to the quality of the image here on the screen. As mentioned, stick around to the end and I'll hopefully post a few different videos actually demonstrating this in darker lit lighting conditions so you can truly appreciate the quality of the the screen and hopefully as well the audio as I'll try and focus more in on the sound actually emitting from the TV than instead of myself but let's very quickly move on to some size comparisons here you have the TVs compared next to a standard six inch scale figure so for those of you who are into action figure photography or just genuinely setting up action figure dioramas I actually think these TVs here won't work too bad at all and so some final thoughts here for these tiny TVs overall I've got to be honest and say that I'm actually pretty surprised at how well they've turned out initially I was a little skeptical as to how they would in fact actually function but they are leaps and bounds more enjoyable than I personally could have ever possibly imagined. The actual inclusion and integration of a real life working TV remote is excellent. I can certainly see younger collectors going crazy for these particular pieces and what took me by surprise the most is the actual quality of the screen itself and the audio. They literally are proper clips taken from Family Guy and the Big Bang Theory and I was expecting them to be perhaps slightly sampled so really really small minute clips but nope some of them are actually pretty long and I was also really surprised how many different variations of clips there were in fact actually included within this you do get a lot and that was something that I certainly wasn't expecting I think they're really really enjoyable and they certainly are completely different from anything that I've either reviewed on the channel or seen myself so definitely worth checking out for those of you who are into these type of things of course check out the link down in the description box below be sure to stick around to the end of the video where I'll show you a few different demos and I want to say a big thank you to basic fun for sending these samples here my way for review I really hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please do let me know down in the comment section below and as always also be sure to let me know what you think of the toys themselves i thank you all for watching and until my next review i'll see you then thanks for watching